how to install Node.js on Windows 11. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and properly install Node.js on your computer. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like and also subscribe to my channel because that really helps me out. So to get started, the first thing we need to do is simply open up a browser and navigate to the official website of Node.js, which is nodejs.org. Check the description. I'll have a link down there. Once you get to nodejs.org, simply find download node. And this is the long-term support version. So that's the one we want. And then save the installation file to our computer. Then just open up that file and most likely it downloaded to the downloads folder on your computer. And then we can begin the installation process. So go ahead and select next. Then just read through the terms and licensing agreement and agree to it. Once you're ready, select next. And then the destination folder for the installation will just be in the program files. So you can select next. And then in addition to that, it's going to install some pack managers, package managers, things like that. I recommend keeping this all default and then selecting next. And then depending on your needs, you might want to select automatically install necessary tools. This is for like Python or Visual Studio Build. I'm just going to go ahead and select that. It doesn't hurt to have that and then select next. After that, select install. And then it will go through the installation process. If it pops up and asks you if you want to allow Node.js to make changes to your device, select yes so that it can install. Then you'll see successfully installed, select finish. And because we selected to install the additional tools, you'll see this terminal window pop up. Go ahead and select any key on your keyboard. They recommend closing all other programs on your computer before installing the required tools. So go ahead and do that and then hit any key on your keyboard and it'll start installing. Give it some time to install all the necessary tools. Then once it's done installing the additional tools, we can simply open it up by selecting the start button and then just typing node and you'll see node.js right here and you can start using it. It'll even give you the current version that you have installed. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel.